My name is Nadja Deming. And my name is Jamie Salou. And this is WJAG TV with your weekly school news. First off, we've got your senior info. For all of you seniors out there, it's time to pay your senior dues of $80. This gets you your senior picnic, senior breakfast, your senior t-shirt, 2017 hoodie, your senior picture, and your gift from the school. You can pay it all at once or make $20 installments. See Ms. Willis in room C203 to pay your dues. Jack Spearware is being sold in the front office. You can choose from two designs and they are only $10. Stop by the office between 8 and 4 and see Ms. Walker, Ms. Link, or Ms. Herb to pick up your shirts. Next, we've got your club and activity news and updates. The Youth Leadership Athens program is designed to develop leadership skills, network with other high schools, and work within the community. 10th and 11th graders are encouraged to pick up an application in the counseling office and turn it in completed by this Friday, September 30th. STEP team is now taking applications. If you are interested in being on the CSHS STEP team, please see Ms. Lonnen in the counseling office. Now to Kayla Davenport with your weekly sports news and student features. Thank you, Nadja. I'm Kayla Davenport, and this is your weekly sports news. Let's give congrats to the freshman football team on their victory against Walnut Grove with a score of 49 to 6. Let's show up and support them at their next game at North Oconee tomorrow, the 29th. Congratulations to our student of the week, Willie Craddock. He wrote and published his own book at the age of 16. Last Friday, the Jacks did their best against Park Central but failed to pull off a win, losing with a score of 38 to 12. Destin Howard and Kayla Page were live at the game to bring you a recap. Last Friday night at the Cedar vs. Central game, the Jaguars started off with a strong start by scoring the first touchdown, but unfortunately they missed the field goal. As a result of the unsuccessful plays and the injuries, this allowed Central to win the game with the final score of 12-38. We interviewed Coach Riles along with following players to see how they reflected on the game. Well, I mean, you always want to beat your cross town rival, so I mean, it's a lesson that we got to learn from it and bounce back. Uh, just stay focused and um, practice well. Basically, we stand focused, uh, preparing ourselves, getting stronger, uh, learning on film and stuff like that. So, preparing ourselves. It just gave us another another thing to accomplish. So, I think we're doing good right now. We're practicing hard. Uh, we had a good practice yesterday, so I think we're preparing well right now. Well, obviously, I'm, I'm disappointed in the outcome because we, a, we didn't, we didn't win the game. B uh, most important, we didn't play as well as we would like to. So, you know, I'm disappointed, but, you know, it happens, and, and we'll regroup and we'll, we'll get ready for this week. Okay. I'll try to improve, uh, correct the mistakes we made, and um, play a little bit more fire and intensity and, and, uh, and try, to, try to get a victory. We expect the same thing each and every day, regardless of who we're playing and what we're doing. We, we expect to be the best we can every day. I expect my coaches and myself to be the best I can every day. So. We just go about our business like we've been doing before. The Jaguars will take on Flowery Branch on the road this Friday. The upcoming events for this week, there will be a football game on Friday at Flowery Branch against 7.30. Volleyball team plays Thursday on the 29th at East Hall at 6 o'clock. Again, my name is Kayla Davenport, and this has been your weekly school news. Now back to you, Nadja and Jamie. Thank you, Kayla. Also, let's give a big hand to our students that participated in helping clean up a local river with the Clean River Program here in Athens. PSB Tutoring is open to all students and meets after school on Tuesday and Thursdays from 345 to 515. There is no sign-up required, and snacks and transportation are provided. All PSB classrooms will be hosted in the Freshman Academy for all subject areas. Contact Mr. Panetta via email and D102 for more details. The Fall College and Career Fair will be on September 29th in the gym. Be sure to attend and get the information you need to be prepared for college. Again, my name is Nadja Deming. And my name is Jamie Salou. And this has been WJAG-TV with your weekly school news. <laughs>